privateering war server is not is is perfect if you need a little danger in your life a little danger a little danger bollocks it's lots of danger it says population low so yes yeah we it's not going to be a lot of players on there trust me what nation are we going with uh england are we going we're going english this time are we okay uh oh, oh okay so pirates are a nation yes pirates okay. are a nation yes it's not a an, an affinity they're an actual nation so what what are the benefits to going great britain uh i have no idea because territory um gets captured a lot on this server uh, and if we log on and we get in there and we find out that the british are not very dominant then this could be very interesting well i think we should go british then yeah should we give it a try yeah for our kins folk call myself captain spike we're a little bit being dominated by the spanish it looks like if you look at if you look yeah it does doesn't it if you look at uh if you look at cuba the north side of that on the pve server is taken over by is owned by the spanish whereas the pirates have got the entire coast there off and then southern um cuba is owned by um the british which is normally owned by the pirates so that's interesting okay if you go south to guatemala there is an island there called great corn if we wanted to practice taking a town Maybe that's the right one to go for. I don't know if that even makes sense. I don't I'm, know if not sure if, I'm not sure if it come if if the towns come up with, uh, it, it it on the PVE server it flags it up saying you can take that port. Right. So I think it might be the same thing for this. Yeah, you can't. We can't really do a cargo run because our our ship will be overloaded. Uh, the weight's too much. We can do a passenger delivery if we wanted to. So that's quite a bit of stuff there. So let's it's see. Quite expensive though. Oh, we got no money again. We've got no money again. Remember. So we're yeah. going to have to do a mission, we're aren't we? Just to get ourselves to going. Passenger run. So if we can do a passenger run where we can stay close to the shore, then we don't have to worry about the big nasty bloke. Closest one to us is Pedro K which is just south of us just out of interest how do you know where we are we're in kingston port royal mate in jamaica i see it yeah the circle on the map okay. yep there's a circle on the map so pedro k is right directly south of us uh, missions are in the book that's yeah. correct yes is this a passenger delivery yes it's a passenger delivery make sure it says pedro k gotcha <laughs> they'll be in your cutter straight away there's also one going to bone oh. Key. yes there is um is, is you, you, let's go for it let's do both of them and let's then we'll both. make a bit more money yeah a bit of extra dosh yeah because we can we can take more than two people most definitely because you know they don't weigh very much humans do they <laughs> I don't know. Some of them do. <laughs> We're basically going south with a bit of west. Yep. We're basically dead ahead. Right, island. We are approaching Highland. It's around the other side of it, though, of the port, I think. Yeah, looks that way. You're dropping me, mate. 24 knots, I'm at. Yeah, you're doing two more than I am. I'm going to go round to the port side and come... Sorry, round to the starboard side and come round to port. Okay. Sounds good. That's pretty much what I was going to do. So what was the other thing you were talking about? A clan. How many people can you have in a clan? It's like it's like a guild sort of thing, you know, like on World of Warcraft. So could you have two battle crews of six engage yeah. in the same battle against an enemy? 
Um, well, I'm just maybe, sure. yes. I think you could. Because it says that when you go into the battle, you can't have more than six. But well, we make that's just you and your group. So maybe you can have two, twelve people go, on, go in and fight. I mean, when you tested the game and showed it on that video that I watched a few years ago, yeah. you had a mountain of ships in there. That's true. How there were quite a lot. In there. there was definitely more than 12, wasn't there? Yeah. I don't Probably know about 20 you, odd. I don't know how the hell you managed to do that. We're going to have to tack in. I mean, the, pri the price of it, I think, for the base game and stuff is, is quite reasonable. To be fair, considering quid. What, yeah, considering what it was when the game first came out, which was thirty pound, yeah, and that that like I literally had to beg my my good lady to buy me this when when I knew that the devs had sorted it, kind of it started to pick up some better re better reviews, and then it's nosedived again, sort of thing. Yeah, yeah, we're going on to the next port, aren't we? Should yeah, we have a look yeah. in the shop and see if there's anything? Drop off some passengers here, aren't we? Yeah, we could see if there's anything. Well, we're going to get paid some money, aren't we, Till? Got a few yeah. stuff here. Grapefruit, white pepper, fine fabrics. Oh, nice. Fine fabrics are a reasonable price. So is grapefruit. Yeah, there's, there's nowhere nearby we can make a profit on that, is there? How much is it to buy it? Can you just just tell me, dead fast? 400 to buy. Right, okay. So, and the I'm best. Very, place. very far out, and I still the don't see any way. The best place we can get is uh, it's 236 kilometers away. Uh, it's too far. 976, um, which is. Um, so, if we drop off at Bone K and then come back here and grab them grapefruits and sail up to there, we can make a bit of coin if you're up for it. Uh, I think I'm getting different prices than you. Oh, Legonaves. I've maxed my bar out completely on grapefruit. So my distance is completely maxed out. And then I've clicked distance and and done it as the furthest away. Yeah. 238,000, yeah. If he's playing authentically, he shouldn't be messing with us, should he? <laughs> Yeah, we're savage, mate, us. Needs to watch out for us cutters. I, I meant more because he's, you know, part of the same country. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, he won't, he won't attack us because we're, 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 he can't. He's, he, he physically can't. Oh, he can't? Okay. So no, he can't... The, game get, the game won't let him. If we were pirates, it might be a different Anyone. Game. If we were pirates, anyone could attack us, right? I think, I think we could get, I think... So if we're British and we decide, do you know what, we hate everybody, can we change to become pirates? Um, no, we'd have to start all over again. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Can't change your affinity halfway Quite through. Quite a few limitations to the game. Well, if you think about it, though, because if... if um, Let's hypothetically say that the wall yeah. is going, not, not going your way. And everyone swaps sides. And yeah. everybody swaps sides, it doesn't make it... It makes it totally unbalanced. Yeah, um, that, is, that is a very good argument. And and that's one of the biggest gripes I've got with Planet Side because you can do that, and I right. love that. I don't know what that is at all. Planet Side is a shoot 'em up where you got three factions that war each other on a on a planet, um, and you have to take points over. And yeah. if you capture every single point, then you've won the planet. You've got okay. tanks, aircraft, all sorts of stuff in that game. It's a really cool game, but you can quite easily switch sides. And that's what people were doing in the game. It's just highly it frustrating. It. Yeah. it does totally, 100%. But it's not a game where you've like, you have to take this certain point. You can literally go behind enemy lines and take over point capture zones that they've already, they already own behind their lines, which was a lot of fun. I just wish this game had like a first person view. Yeah, where you can like on be on the wheel. Yeah. Yeah, it'd be cool that wouldn't it? You're loving this, aren't you? I'm 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 having a lovely time over here. 
<laughs> I, I, I like your coconut. I like I like it very much. <laughs> and what happens when you rank up then? What does that what it means what we get we unlock more unlock more ships to sail, my friend. We can't sail them unless we have the rank. Which, which means we can get potentially get two ships. We can get one for trading and we can get one for combat. We can get ourselves a brig for trading and we can get ourselves a um, either a snow or a rattlesnake for combat. All right, that sounds good. That sounds like we've got a bit of a lucky break you, on the start. Do you want to stay on this server and add, add to the risk of getting butchered by players? Yeah, I don't see why not. All right, okay. No problem. I think, uh, you know, the more we play, the more battles we get into, the more we'll learn. How to run I think it also we could be quite, you know, aggressive in sort of head into Spanish water and start taking out their uh, NPCs. Yeah. Yeah. If we find one of the right rank and whatnot. Yeah. If you mouse over grapefruit really quickly, it does actually tell you, and I never noticed this before, it does actually tell you how many um, grapefruits a ship can carry. It says 28 for me. That's pretty handy. That's pretty handy, isn't it? So I'm going to buy 28. Oh, yeah. Uh, how long did it take us? Well, it's just gone 10 minutes now, so I reckon about 7 to 8 minutes that was. All right. So it's probably about 15 minutes for the next sale. Oh, right. I'm ready to leave port. You ready to leave port? I'm ready to leave port. All right, I'll leave port then. And I'm then... going to go port side and round that way, I think. Yeah, okay, cool. As soon as I get in the world, I'm going. Well, you, you're a lot faster than me, mate. Like, you're in the game already. Right, time is away. So, if it said... If it just a says... Big ship. Just says attack underneath it, then that means it's an NPC player. You'll okay. see... and it, 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 On the portrait, you'll see enemy player. I think you can also tell the difference between a player and an NPC by how fast the ship's going. Oh, I okay. If they're bobbling, bobbling along, then you know you've. Uh, we seriously, mate. We need to play some Sea of Thieves. We really do. Yeah, I think that I think that's definitely on the cards. You name your own ships now. Yeah. I, do you know, I made a video, uh, like a news update video. I should have kept it. I made it in a sort of, in a, in a jokey kind of way. Oh, did you? Right, okay. And, I, and the, it's like after I did all the news about all these simulation games, the last thing I mentioned was, um, and Sea of Thieves have now brought in the captaincy update which means that you can own your own ship and name it and change the color and stuff and i'm showing all the trailer in that and i said but i don't think anybody cares i'm not particularly bothered myself and when it cuts back to me i've got like a captain's hat on with a beard and a pipe <laughs> in my head which i thought would be quite funny quality <laughs> yeah i lost my confidence on that so i think i deleted it so i don't know people just got ripped the piss out of me <laughs> I don't know why I care at, at, at the time. I don't really care. Oh, we've just gone over my twenty-minute mark. Twenty-one minutes in. I I reckon I could have made this in twenty minutes because I've slowed down you, quite a lot for yeah, you. I, re I reckon you could have made it twenty minutes. Oh, aren't you nice. I'm lovely, aren't I? Slowed down for his mate. Oh. Three times I slowed down for you. Three now. times you slowed down for me. Good gravy. And he's still not there. How fast I are you going right, now? I'm right next to you. What are you on about? Oh, there you Hi. are. Hi. Finally. Hi. Because you're tacking, that's what it is. Yeah. <laughs> what you, you, You're totally headed in the wrong direction. Yeah, I am. 
<laughs> I stopped watching ages ago. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Got bored. <laughs> I was only doing 13 knots. We dropped down from 50 to 30. You're like, you yeah, know, whatever. 50 knots, mate. That was storming, that was. Anything I hear at this speed, I don't. it's not going to make any difference. <laughs> Do you know that's what they say in sailing? When you're coming into a port, they say don't oh, sail any faster than you're willing to hit something. Uh, really? Yeah. <laughs> oh, see, now you find speed. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you're an inland sailor, aren't you? It's a red. It's a red place. What does this mean? <clears throat> Are they going to start shooting at us? Please tell us we can go here. Is this going to be a problem? I'll be upset if we can't, because I've just yeah. wasted 23 minutes of my life. These cannons for, start shooting at us. A port that I can't go to. Nah, they won't start shooting at us, because it, 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 it would require combat. Enemy port, it says. You can't go in. You're joking? Nope. Ah. Oh. How oh, well, at least we learned something new. Yep, and we got enough grapefruits to sink the Titanic. <laughs> I know, right? Let's uh, let's have a, let's go and have a look at the thingy then. The trader tool dead fast. Should entitle this video: "Couple of noobs play evil <laughs> <laughs> <Evil> action." <laughs> Ever wondered what not to do? Yeah, yeah. This is what you don't do. We, we did these mistakes, so you didn't have to. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's the title we need. Yeah, that works. Oh, I sent was on the other side of the island, but yeah. it's um, it's not British. But does that necessarily mean that they're an enemy? Yeah, I would think that everybody on the map's an enemy. So then these free ports, or free towns, or whatever they're called, will sell to anyone. Yeah. 11 grand. So if I make more than 11 grand, I'm in profit. Do things go out of date? Uh, no. Well, there's a ton of stuff here, mate. Yes. Absolute ton of stuff. So don't forget to put it in your warehouse from your hold and then scroll all the way down in trading and tell me how much money they're going to buy it off you for. 237. Yeah, I thought it would be exactly the same. Uh, don't sell, though, because we're only going to make six grand profit, and that means we're going to lose between six grand. We're not going to make six grand profit at all. We're going to make six grand. No, we we're just going to make six grand loss, yeah. yeah. Ah, prices were updated 12 hours ago. All ah, right, okay. So the prices do change. Yeah. Okay. I'm trying to find us a much better price to a place that we can sell it to. So realistically, then, any of these places could be better. And I don't, and I don't know whether or not the server sets it up so you can only attack certain places. I don't think everything is a free-for-all. That's just uh, my me going on an assumption. Right. I'll, not in not that's not gospel because i don't forget i've never played on the pvp server before sure yeah uh, well based uh, on what I, what i'm seeing there i think if you want to attack a port and it's within the hours of being attackable then you can just go and attack it what attacking a port actually includes uh, i have no idea uh, us getting annihilated by port cannon fire, I would think. I suspect these, so, but then... ships. What would we be shooting at? Uh, other ships or the actual port itself? I would think other ships that are defending them ports and um, port defences. But if there's only 120 people online, there's a good chance that some of these ports are not going to be defended by ships. You, 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 you would think that. So you would rock up, get your old spyglass out, have a look. Depends how hardcore the people on this flipping game are, right? Yeah. Frontier. 
I'm going around, I'm going around the port side of this because these are sandbars. And I think... If, I don't... Yeah, I don't... Can I get through here? Not sure if you can or not. If you look at your map, no, it's looking... you know, it, it, it's all white round where you are. You're going to have to come back around the other way. I think you're right. Well, that could be a lovely little trap that you could bring an enemy into if they don't know this area. Which is kind of cool. It's uh, Parts of this game are really growing on me. Have I made it more enjoyable for you? 100%. Um, not oh. just because of your lovely company, but because okay. you've been very helpful in sort of getting me up and running. You're going to hit that ship, dude. Yeah, it just goes through it, look. Does, Does it? it? Oh, yeah, I didn't yeah. know that. Yeah, he goes through every boat on the, in the game, unless you're attacking him. Uh, the, the, the only place that we could sell this and get a really good profit on it is in Terraborn and according to my trader tool and Terraborn is all the way up in um, in the Gulf of Mexico in America I, yeah I don't really understand how we've got comp so I mean I could understand slightly different but so completely different seems a bit weird yeah see I've got 274 do you want to go and have a look and then if we pass pass by Neeps and it says available for all, we can see if we can get in there. Okay. Like, just see if the stuff's white or not. Don't right, forget right. to pick up your grapefruits. Don't pick your grapefruits up. <laughs> <laughs> About to leave then, without them. I, I did almost exactly the same yeah. thing. Yeah. Thankfully, the devs have done something good, and they remind you that you're an idiot every time, yeah. <laughs> every time yeah. you leave a port. Absolutely. Okay. Oh, stupid, you've left your keys behind. Yeah. Right. I'm near the nipples. <laughs> Colour is it? It looks awfully Chinese. It does, doesn't it? It's Russian now. No, it's Chinese. Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah, we can go in. Oh, we can go in, right, okay. Cool. So available for all means that we can get in, and then if you see a trade tax, the chances are we might not be able to get in there, depending on if everybody's enemies to each other. Right, let's see how much we can get a, get for it here then. 396. Uh, okay. That's a loss, but a lot less of a loss than what we were looking at. Let me see if, uh, how much I'm going to lose on that. Before I make a decision. Plus, you don't have to move the grapefruit to your thing to look at it. Yeah, Terraborn. Were, um, so I've got a um, trade tool on the internet for this game. Um, and Terraborn are the only ones that are buying it at decent profit. And it's 720. And they're all the way in bloody America. Right. Grapefruits right now. So if you have a look at... Let's have a look at something here. I mean, we're, it's all well and good sailing around making a bit of cash. Um, but we can also do with some um, doubloons as well. Um, you know, it's, it's, it's a real shame that you can't sort of search and see who's buying stuff in this screen. It's a shame you have to go to the map. To... Yeah. Oh, am I stopping? I need to stop because you haven't left yet, have you? Oh, I didn't realise you'd left. Sorry. All right. Go on. Um, all of the islands with little yellow pluses on are free to trade, regardless oh, of their okay. nationality. Right, OK. And the ones with little stars, yellow stars, they are um, free towns completely. OK. So I, I guess the reason for the free towns is if you... Uh, I'm coming up on you real fast here. Yeah. Um, if your chosen country or whatever has absolutely no ports at all, you can still sell something somewhere. Yeah. Yeah, well, looks that like might it. be. Are you are you happy to play on this knowledge and whatever? Are you happy to play on this server, or do you want to go back to the other one? Yeah, no, I'm quite happy. Yeah. Right. Okay. Oh, okay. So this ship here in front of us has got no fleet. That, you you, you want to attack 
something that beastie. Well, I, I don't know if it's just a cargo I ship with no cannons. I can't tell. <laughs> how do you how do you know if you want to attack something? Okay, there's a little shit over here, a trader's brig. It looks tiny. That, that, my friend, is the biggest boat in the game. What, the trader's frig? I want the ship that you've just asked about. Well, this one here to my left. Battle rate in 900. This one here? Which, which one's this one here? Oh, one? That, little one there, that little one there. What is it, a trader's brig? Yeah. Do you, want, do you want to go slap it? If you want. Come on then, let's swing in and slap it then. All right. Not that he's done us any harm, but hey. Ah, no, we'll just attack the flipping Russians or whoever the fuck they are. How do you know what his rating is? Because I can't see any of that information. I've got an inv I've got a website web page opened up. You're a naughty cheater. No, I'm not a naughty cheater. I'm clever. <laughs> Right, I'm 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 sweeping in. Are you in the circle yet? I'm in the right. I'm in the cycle. I'm attacking. I'm attacking. Do I have to click as well? Yeah, I would. Just in case. Right, I'm attacking him. <laughs> <laughs> this is where they knew they effed up. I haven't even got any rum here, mate. This is gonna end in disaster. I've got to get my sails sorted yeah, got, out. Got, here we go, here we go. I've got some good hits on him there. Uh, you gave me a good slap on the wrist there. I need to sails. Coming inside you. Need not have come inside you, never mind. You know that ship's not involved in this fight. Yeah, yeah. It's coming this way. But he's a British ship, so he shouldn't be right. shooting at us, right? No, no, no. We're gonna we're gonna have an ally in this battle. He's white. If you open up the map and zoom out a little bit, okay, you'll see that he's. Uh, I'll take your word for white. it. He's got a lot of guns. Which is pretty awesome. The problem is with, with with us. He's he's a lot. This guy seems to be a lot faster. It does, which is weird, because we're in cutters, which should be the fastest. So I hit his sails again, and his mast. I'm going to concentrate on trying to get some speed upon him, rather than trying to shoot him. Well, I'm glad I turned then. What the green eagle? I'm doing loads of damage to his sails and his mast, but I'm not seeing anything pop up on the on the. Yeah, just take a little bit for it to come down. You've got 99% like, speed, apparently. 100%. Um, so when you said what angle are you doing, what were you what were you asking about? Bottom left hand corner, you'll see your compass. Yeah, three degrees on is my current heading. Three. Uh, now which way is it? the way it's facing? It's uh, is the numbers on the on the outer edge of the circle. I'm right in range of his guns, I'm a bit concerned, I'm going to turn instead. Four hull, one crew. Any chance you could figure out how to load up grapple shot and then I can... Yeah, you press your corresponding button. <laughs> So one or two, and then press number two. It'll it'll load grape shot up for you. Ah, okay. Yeah, you got it. Okay. So I think I can slow him down, and it's going to be a lot easier to hit him as well. Then. Yeah. Obviously, two of us firing at him. He's very low at the back, I have to say. 
Oh, yeah, you, you'll probably overtake me now. Oh, I felt that one. Taking my first bit of damage. No, he's hit you hard on the left side. Yes. I'm going to thank him for that by blowing his head off. <laughs> turning is turning. I must admit, Mike, this is a lot of fun, mate. This is a lot of fun. He could have some on him. Shooting. Shock again. Yeah. 11 on the sails, one on the mast. They're catching him now. Yeah, he's down to 87%. Good, good call getting the grape shot out, mate. Definitely caught him up. You've lost the wind again there, mate. I have, yeah, I got I got a bit distracted. I'm trying to swap my cannons over. Or my shot over, I should say. You know that if you press space bar, you can do one shot shot. I do left. now. I do left. now. Left click your mouse, it unleashes the full volley. You can do precision shots if you do space bar. Sorry, I thought you knew that already. That's all right. Come on, mate, stick it to him. Fire! Hole one. I think I must have hit the water a lot. Yeah. But I'm going to take an absolute volley from him now. Down there. Ah. 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 Bringing the numbers back to an even amount. I think they've just turned the tide a bit. Boarding lost. Yeah, they just... We were winning that whole thing. And then all of a sudden they just... Um that looked pretty good. Yeah, three it. Two Not bad two, from that distance. Two hole, one crew. But for 11 men they've got left. 17 according to my screen. Okay. They must have resurrected some from the dead. <laughs> yeah, maybe. I don't, I don't know. Smart, Doctor Smart sorted him out. Cheated, I think that's what it is. Let me see if I can catch him and board him. Can you, are you watching me or are you just sat at your boat? I'm watching. Oh, can you actually see my boat? Well, I don't know how it works. I've never died, so... All right, smart times. <laughs> <laughs> you think I'm catching him? Very slowly. What speed are you doing? I can't see any of your details. 10.6. It's quite slow. I don't understand why you're so slow. I don't even know which way the wind is blowing. I can tell from your telltales. The wind's blowing off to my right. Yeah. Like fully right. Oh, I just managed to get all right on the cusp of reloading my chain shot. It switched it to ball right on the cusp. Well, I didn't have to wait a full reload round for my uh, ball to come back. 
Oh, nice. That was clever. So when you press spacebar, does it just fire from right to left, like front to back? Yeah. So when you yeah. when you look at the when you look at it, you'll see an extra. Um, do you, when 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 you right click, you get the funnel, don't you? The the white funnel of where you're yeah. going to shoot. Yeah? yeah. You get an extra funnel inside of that where the individual cannon's going to shoot from. And each time you press the space bar, the funnel moves over to the next cannon. So you can place your shots. Okay. But if you keep slowing him down... Oops, some of those me, hit. It's hitting me like that. Uh, go, go to Kingston and I'll meet you there if you like. Roger. Where's Lee? Where's, oh, bloody hell, yeah, okay. I mean, you, the Admiralty would have given you a, a fresh ship at Leo Gun, but oh. if it's going to teleport you to Kingston, then that's even better. But I have no ship, is the problem. You, you, okay, so what you need to do is you'll see like a, a gavel icon at the bottom of the screen. You'll yeah. be able to buy your new ship from there. For free? Yes. Costs you nothing. The level 7. Yeah, rank 7 boat. Oh, oh. So, the, I can't buy any other ship because I don't have the rank for it? Is that what, what the situation correct, is? Yeah. yeah, that's correct. You need to get your... Um, we, we need to get 500 experience to get to the next rank and then we'll have more ships to pick from yeah you just get yeah. one extra ship per rank or how does it work oh hell no hell no hell no you get a few um, yeah we get a few so at the moment we can pilot five boats we can do a lynx a basic cutter a cutter a privateer or a pickle right um we and can then... do that now yes Okay. But we've got how do you, to buy them. How do you know you can do that? Because I don't see those ships. There. I suppose what we could do is get one ship that's a good fighter and one ship that's a good trader, and then you could sort of protect me or vice versa as we trade and make the killing. I I honestly think that we can we should own one of each. Yeah. Really? Yeah, uh, and 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 we can. I mean, you saw how much the brig took a, a pound in. Um, to sink it, and it ran. But yeah. we're not people that run, are we? Really? Not really. So. I <laughs> Let the bass kick. Let the let the bass let the bass kick. Let the 